here in East Tennessee, Cherokee Health Systems has 21 brick and mortar sites and two mobile clinics to serve 13 counties. The federally qualified health center serves a variety of communities, including the growing Hispanic population in our area. Leaders at the health center say 20% of patients do not speak English, and out of that, 80% speak Spanish. During Hispanic Heritage Month, 10 News anchor Sam Perez gives us a glimpse of the center's vision as it looks ahead to the future. I have many dreams. Asaya Labrador has a vision for the future of Cherokee Health Systems. We need more interpreters, more training, more translation, more of everything. <laughs> she came to the health center as a patient five and a half years ago. Soon after, Labrador became a Spanish-English interpreter. It was kind of serendipitous. Originally from Venezuela, she sees firsthand how language can be a barrier for patients. You feel so vulnerable. You feel like... You are in a bubble, isolated, not heard, and scared because you may have a lot of things to say about how you feel and not all of it can come across. We want to find the people that need help, that need us, and get them in and give them as much of that wraparound care as they need. Vice President of Medical Services Gail Riley has her sights set on providing care to underserved communities, including the Hispanic population, through brick and mortar locations and mobile clinics. We want community, any community in the Hispanic community as one of those communities to feel welcome here. Through cultural humility trainings, diverse hiring practices, and continued outreach centers, Labrador says the Community Health Center's future is bright. My dream that I don't know if it will be possible would be to have an army of interpreters for them to interpret in person in all the clinics, to have an ASL interpreter, to have um, translation services. Gradually making that vision a reality. In Knoxville, I'm Sam Perez. So far in 2024, Cherokee Health Systems has served more than 14,000 Hispanic patients.